Lucid dreaming does feel like reality in some ways, but in a lot of ways, it's also very different to reality. And what a lot of people don't realize is that it's, although it, you're using your conscious mind to experience a lucid dream, that doesn't mean it's exactly like base reality or you know what you're experiencing right now. So there's kind of a distinction. Although you're in both situations, right? Now, as you're watching this video and in a lucid dream, you are, I guess you could say present, right? Your consciousness is grounded and you know you're, isn't, you know it's you experiencing that thing. It's very difficult to define consciousness, by the way, but you know that it's you experiencing that moment. At the same time, it's a different awareness. You're aware that you're there and experiencing the moment, but it's different. It's not the same as reality. And the best way I can think of explaining this is that in reality, like let's say now, for example, you're aware of this moment, you can experience it, you can look around and you know see things and interact with things, but there's a lot of stability, a huge amount of stability, because obviously things don't change around you. The, the scene doesn't change around you in reality. In a dream, however, it does. You know, you can be looking at your computer screen and then you look up and now you're in a different city. Or you walk down the road, you turn around and now you're in a desert. These kind of changes don't happen in reality, or at least they don't unless you're hallucinating in some way. So there's a lot of stability. You know pretty confidently that the scene around you is gonna stay pretty stable in reality. In a dream, however, you don't have that sense of stability. So the whole world feels kind of like fluid and changeable. Although you're in the center of that as the point of experience, the lucid mind, it's still unstable. Even when you're fully lucid, you still have this sense that everything or anything could change at any moment around you. Like the scene could change, the building could fall down, a dragon could come you know, down the street, whatever. And so in that way, it's very different to reality because it lacks that stability. That being said, the awareness that you that you experience in both a lucid dream and in reality, like for example now, they're very similar, but the reality that you're experiencing is different. I think that's probably the best way of explaining this, right? So the awareness is similar, but the, the reality that the awareness is experiencing is different.